guys welcome back to day 19 of vlogmas um i'm just gonna be blunt i just got out of work i am completely fried and whew, i give great props to those youtubers that vlog every year for vlogmas because it is a lot of work. I now I can understand now why they start at least a couple days beforehand. But geez, trying to come up with content and trying to, and vlogging every single day for 25 days straight, it's like mentally exhausting. Especially when you have to work full time and you don't get out to like almost six o'clock. Whew. Wow, I just, I am so glad that it is the 19th. We have only a couple days left of Vlogmas and we're almost done, which I've kind of enjoyed doing these vlogs, I have to say. Um, probably not 25 days worth of vlogs, but I have enjo enjoyed doing it. And letting you guys see a peek into my life outside of my hands for videos. And I'm thinking about doing it going forward once in a while so that you guys can see what I'm up to, you know, outside of budgeting and such. But um, right now I just finished work. I'm going to head to Walgreens because I have to pick up my mom's cigarettes. And then I'm gonna head home. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I already went to UPS because I had to return that filter. I did during my lunch break because I, I didn't know what time the UPS store closed. And I just didn't want to chance it and I just figured I want to get it out and done with. So yeah, I did that and yeah, I'm going, I'll meet you guys. Maybe I'll video at Walgreens, maybe I won't. I have no idea. So I'll see you in a little bit.
as I just finished at Walgreens and I'm heading home. You know, I'm noticing as we get closer to Christmas, people, you know, Christmas is, Christmas time is supposed to be like the happiest time of the year, but people are just like getting meaner and meaner as we get closer to Christmas. I'm like, it, it's not that serious, guys. Like, I went to the UPS during my lunch, right? I was behind this lady, and this guy came in right after this, this older gentleman, and he just like bypassed us. He was like, I'm not gonna wait. And just went right for the guy. Didn't say sorry or excuse me or anything. He just went right past us. And then the lady in front of me, she got a little upset and she went right, went, she went to the other person. She said, this guy just cut in line and just got out right away. And she said it right when he was there. So I was like, she's not wrong. So yeah, things are, I don't know. I feel like as you get older, people just get meaner during Christmas. And I don't understand that it's supposed to be a happy time. I even had somebody who told me, that he didn't really want to celebrate Christmas because it's too much of a headache and annoyance. Who wants to put a Christmas tree up or lights up? That's the fun of it, right? But, you know, what do I know? I'm just gonna try to keep my cheerful self going for Christmas because it's literally on Sunday. So there we go. All right, I'm gonna head home, see if my mom started cooking or not and see Oreo, of course. You know, I have to get my cuddles in, so if he lets me. He always gives me a glare, so yeah. Let's see what happens. So I look a hot mess, but that's all right, because I'm at home. Um, as you guys just saw, I just poured myself some hot cocoa because it is actually cold here in South Florida. I know, right? It was in the 50s this morning, and it's still a bit cold, so I'm super excited. Plus, I just found out that we're getting a cold front for Christmas. I know for everybody else it's like everybody up north it's like why would you want to why are you excited about the cold because it's always hot here <laughs> even during the time when it's supposed to be cold it is hot so i am super excited we rarely get any cold days so super super excited about it also i have something that i want to show you guys so I am doing a little giveaway as a thank you to all my subscribers. It's not a lot, but it's the thought that counts. So I have this Joanna Parker Santa and Reindeer mug set. And it's a very popular... Joanna Parker is very popular. I mean, people go crazy for this. It's like the new Ray Dunn. So as a thank you, I am doing a giveaway my first ever giveaway. So I will be giving this away to whoever wins. Um, so the rules, you have obviously have to be subscribed, of course. Um, let's see, this is like a fly. This is just fly on my seatbelt kind of thing. So obviously you have to be a give a subscriber. You have to like the video and let's see do leave a comment and in that comment tell me do a hashtag mug set that's the hashtag hashtag mug set mug set m-u-g set so yeah that's it's pretty easy very easy and i will announce the giveaway winner on let's say give everybody time since it's Monday I will give everyone until next Monday because obviously it's gonna be Christmas this coming week so we don't want to have I'm obviously not gonna be able to get it to you by Christmas because you know shipping and everything is late but you have until Monday which is gonna be the 26th and I will be pulling the winner on that day. So yeah, surprise. <laughs> so yeah, um, I'm, I'm excited. This is my first giveaway. <laughs> so.
so yeah i'm a bit nervous i hope people actually do the giveaway i've never done one so i'm excited i hope you guys are excited i think this is actually a very cute set and i know a lot of people want it so i know it's going for quite a lot of mercari so i think it's very cute so i'm not a pink person i do like pink but it's not my favorite color i'm more of a blue type of person but I think it's really cute. The way they did it, like in a pastel kind of pink, is actually very cute. So, yeah, that's the giveaway. Kind of snuck it in here. Just so you guys could have a better chance if you do re um, watch my videos. I will put the rules down below. Just be publicly subscribed, like the video. Leave a comment with hashtag mug set, M U G set. And yeah, I will pull the winner next Monday on the 26th. 26th. I can't talk today. So yeah, that is pretty much my vlog. I'm just going to finish my hot cocoa that's now getting cold. I have a color changing mug that my mom got me for it from Home Goods last year. And I'm so excited. I love, but it's very cute. Um, yeah. So we're so close to the end of the year. Yee. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna leave you guys here. I'm gonna continue to watch my Asian dramas. I'm really into it. Plus, I have to start. <laughs> I've been really bad this vlog, miss. I've been watching like here and there some YouTube channels and I'm very behind. So actually I'm going to put a pause on the agent channels dramas and I'm going to try, I'm going to go onto all my subscribe, all the YouTube video, all the YouTube channels that I'm subscribed to and go back and watch them because I've been, I've been like, I've been bad. I've been watching here and there, but I'm just missing them. I did go back to D versus Debt yesterday and watch two videos. I have to go back a couple days more. I have quite a few I need to go back to. And I've I've also I also watch Caleb Hammer. He's a financial guy. Um but instead of like cash stuffing and budgets, he actually interviews real life people and asks them about their budgets, their debts. It's really interesting people's perspective. Some of them are like, yeah, I know I messed up. I know I have to fix it, but I don't know how. And then there's some who are, <laughs> who like justify <laughs> the way they spend. And a lot of them are in so much debt and they don't really care. So it's very interesting. I would definitely recommend you guys going to watch him. His videos are like every day with somebody new. So really interesting. Um, I'll try to link him down below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 20. I hope you guys don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe if you want to be a part of if you want to be a part of the giveaway. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.